Hey guys, what's up? So today I'm going to be showing you a quick tutorial so you can go to mcpedl.com, have it, show you how to download these mods, add-ons, everything. You see it's amazing. So as all these mods are here, look at them, cool, you got some maps, it's really awesome. So see this bunch of maps, add-ons, mods. All these things. There's even more. It's not like just little. And then of course you got that three dots button with search. So but we just got this nether features one that we just have up here. As you can see we have all these things like shaders, mods, apps, maps, sorry. Yeah, and um you can see like Zoglins. Now look. One thing though that does happen though is sometimes you see all these, so always get like the dot mc add on, not zip, because that's not easy. You will have to get the resource pack and the thing for most things, but you just have to go to there. And this is not the normal one, normally add fly, but this is taking us here. So as you see right here, all you have to do on linkverse.com, it's a little common, all you have to do is press discover interesting articles. Just look, you don't have to read anything. Don't read anything. Just press the X button, wait 10 seconds, and you'll be amazed. So you don't have to like read any articles, really easy. There, then you continue. Now you can't, look, so you see it's right here. In the bottom, you have to pay for that to see the other things. Just go back to the um, mcpedl.com. You can just find those other things, but really cool is look. So you can just press that right there, direct access. Then you come to mediafire.com, which is a great website. Just click right there, and then download. Now, so you're going to go, so you see your iCloud Drive. Right now, it'll go to your iCloud Drive, most likely. So you're going to go in your iCloud Drive. Well, make sure you know what the name of it is called. So as you see, it is downloading. They don't normally have to download. This one just took a little bit more data. So it's right there. Just click it, press copy. So then here, make sure you press copy. And you're not going to stay in here. You're not going to stay in here. You're going to go to on my phone. Make sure you're in here or it won't work. So when you load it, it'll say invalid. So it has to be in Minecraft. No, it doesn't have to be in any folders. Just, like, just paste it in here. Just press paste. Now you're going to take it. You're going to tap on it, but make sure it is in Minecraft when you do it, because a lot of people don't put it in, and that's how it doesn't work. So it's going to go into Minecraft. So you can do this with most things, and the worlds are very similar, too. But do note that, well, that's a weird loading. And do note that one thing that does happen a lot is that it doesn't work because people don't have experimental on, or people don't have both the resource and... With the resource is basically the textures, and then the behavior pack, which which just makes the way they behave. So you need to have both of them, or it's not gonna work. Now, for some reason, this one, um, I don't know what's going on, but I don't know why it doesn't work. I might have to restart it too, but it's not gonna be for mo most ones. This one, it's probably just because I just um the behavior pack. Probably just I have to reset the world, but. I'm not gonna do that. Minecraft's a little weird sometimes it doesn't load. But here, so I just want to show you one more thing. So you have your files right here. Sometimes if it doesn't work, just reload the pack. Sometimes. And then that should work. So it would come up, you would see that. Also, when it comes in, you would see a little notification thing at the top in Minecraft that says level import started. It, so, oh, wait, okay. See, see import started. Now it's going to say fail because I just did it before when it didn't load. But it actually did. It would say level import started. Then level import completed. Then it would say the pack. See? So you see it's right there. Then right here, just go to create new world. But this is the most important step. So I'm just going to do a test. Um, I would put it in creative, but the most important step right here, out of all these things, you don't have to touch anything, there's just one thing you need, which is 
experimental gameplay. So with that it on, nope, not going to work, so keep it on. So what you're going to do is you're going to make sure you're going to go to My Packs, as you see, and Active, not there. So in My Packs, you can see, you can scroll down, there's all these packs. These are the resource packs, which are the textures, so that's it. So this one automatically like goes on, and it's good. But you have to make sure you activate the behavior pack, too. Well, it's not going to work. Sometimes they automatically, this one does. But I don't see it for some reason because I don't exactly really know what's going on this one. You get the um, behavior pack, how to download it. But it's the same way. And mostly I found that that only certain ones, when in the beginning I thought, that they mostly have to do the behavior. And sometimes, normally, it just comes in one pack. So you just have to load it once. It's open one thing once and it goes in. Make sure experimental gameplay is on. Most of the things from them will be given to you by the slash give command so i like to do slash give at s or at a which a is all just think of it all for all players and then another member is s is the self so it's really easy so a is if you want to give it to a lot of players but s is so right here you can see that Right here, yeah, here it is. They added um, Zoglin. There's more things, there's more things. Just, I think it has to be given through command or something. Find it somewhere, it doesn't matter. We're just showing you real quick. Like, so it will not load because for some reason, I have the textures, but without the behaviors and the textures, it doesn't exactly work. That's just a texture. So, so as you see, that is super cool. And right here, let's get some obsidian. And we're going to go to the nether, maybe. You know what? Maybe not, because you don't have to, because what is, I'm just going to show you, like, so as you can hear some weird sounds, I know that there is a download for actually no sounds, but remember, don't get zip, activate, don't get dot zip ever. Always activate, um, experimental gameplay, and, and there you go. So that is pretty cool, right? So I just want to show you one more thing too. The last thing we leave is we're gonna go here. So this is one thing that you keep seeing. Might. So look, it says virus warning. No. That is not it's just an ad from another thing. So it is after you download it, there's nothing going on. Also when you get something, do like comments. When they say they use those like sleazy and stuff. I understand, like, they're kind of greedy and stuff with these ad fly just to, like, go to there just to do it. But just whatever you do, don't click on any of the ads or anything. So, that's pretty nice. Okay, so wait 15 seconds. Don't click direct link, remember. You just wait 15 seconds and you can continue to the another features add-on. That's what we did, so, pretty good. So we got it, so I am going, to, it does say, so whenever you wanna make a video about any of this stuff, just um, the creator, just credit him, Team Infinite Minds, thank you so much for reading this. In the description, I will send a link to this mod, but I also wanna give you